adventure with minor biker I am once again at Teton Pass I am here to ride the one trail left now that I have not yet ridden here at Teton Pass so in the two times I've been here before I'd ridden everything except for Phillips Canyon and lithium my wife and I did Phillips Canyon earlier this trip take that one off the list so now the last one to take off the list up here at T-Town Pass is the Lithium Trail. It's supposed to be steep, rowdy, wild. Big jumps and stuff at the bottom. I'm sure it'll be too big for me, but I can ride around those. I'm more for the, the steep rowdiness down the ridge and stuff, which it sounds like this trail has plenty of. So it should be super fun. Here we go. The Lithium Trail at T-Town Pass. trail fork just climbed up from where my wife dropped me off at the pass straight ahead is the black canyon trail done that one three years ago there you go lithium trail trail is steep and contains enhanced natural and constructed features all right sounds fun let's do it i'm usually pretty good at handling Steep and gnarly. The rest of it I should be pretty good on, I think. But we'll find out. Whoa! Climb those roots. <laughs> Whoo! I think it starts out pretty wide open down through the meadows. So you get on the ridge section, then it gets deeper and wild. Good breaking bumps. <laughs> Pretty for the view. Off to the south. Oh, I'm breaking up. Better to ride it earlier in the season before you still beat up. But, hey, I'm here in September because it's one of them up here. This guy's been getting some rain. So pretty packed in, not too loose. Just a lot of brake bumps.
Oh, that's steep. <laughs> Definitely doable, but I'm not sure I'm feeling it. <laughs> That's cool. Nice. That was way cool about that. Dude, that's awesome. I love that kind of stuff. I know, you guys smoking hot. Woo! 
wow, that was awesome. some cows right now. I got a couple brake rotors at work. <laughs> I think now is where it starts getting more start getting more features and stuff built down in here somewhere. Definitely not going to be hitting these big jumps, but maybe some of the drops and maybe some smaller jumps might be within my skill set. A lot of root. What have we here? of a gap jumper. Thanks for asking. What's this guy got? I got just a drop. dropping slabs in the forest. Pretty sick. Price of admission right there. Woo! 
<laughs> that was cool as heck. Got some of the little gaps. That one jump off the rock. So I didn't miss all the jumps. <laughs> Definitely didn't hit all the big the big gaps. That's okay. I rode everything else pretty well, I think. Big old steam boilers here in the forest. Guessing left over probably from sawmill or something like that. Hi, my friend. Don't mind me. Yeah, I think I rode it all pretty well. The only thing I walked was that that really steep loose climb and then that one really rocky off camber spot. Just wasn't feeling everything else here. Rode it out just fine. Hello everyone, there we have it. Finally take that off. Only took me three times coming up to Teton Pass to finally ride lithium. But holy cats, that was cool as heck. That top part, nice wide open, switch back down through the meadows, full of braking bumps. Holy cow, that was chattery. And then that ridge line section got all that except for that one off cambered rock bit and that steep climb, that was steep and loose. Got everything else. How do you want to do it? I don't know. And then that bottom section, yeah, I didn't hit all the big gap jumps, but it was still super cool. Got some of the smaller jumps, got the big rock rollers, and just all the flow and chopping down through the roots and stuff. So good. So stoked to finally take that one. And we got Phillips Canyon this trip as well. That gets everything off my to-do list here at Teton Pass. Not that I'll never come here again, but that'll be back to ride stuff again instead of being after new stuff. Thanks everybody for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Yeah, check out other videos that will be linked in the cards in the upper hand corner of this one. Check out Fazari Bicycles as always. My LaSalle Peak handled that much easier than I did. I was definitely the weak link in the team. And leave us a comment down below. I like that hit button. Keep digging up new places to ride and adventure in the great outdoors. Under your own power is always the best.